Some people love playing on the playground or playing on turf, but if you have a disability, there isn't always an option to do that. Soon that's all changing with the new accessible indoor park in Rochester. ABC 6 News Good Morning reporter Sydney Zatz is outside the location of the new park this morning. Good morning, Sydney. Good morning, Devin. It doesn't look like much right now, and you probably can't see at home, but there is a large green space behind me that soon, this time next year, will be the home of Sumcell's new indoor accessible park. The locate off Superior Drive and Badger Hills Drive Northwest, there will be a playground, sensory equipment, a full basketball court, and indoor turf space, just to name a few things. The prime um, accessibility piece is we are constructing a, a ramp that, that goes beyond just the, the ADA compliant uh, slopes and integrating the place, playground and play structures within that ramp structure. So it'll have different landing pads as you can wrap around. The project will cost just over $10 million. Schuler says there will be a price for admission, but that could change over time. Some cell is hoping to break run later this month. And just for reference, the high V on West Circle Drive, the roundabout next to it, if you take the third exit, there's a large green space over by apartment complex. That's where this new facility will be. Again, they're hoping to break ground sometime this month with this facility opening sometime this time next year. In Rochester, Sydney Zatz, ABC 6 News. Good morning.